What's up, guys? I am Doug DeMarco, and let's unbox some stuff, man. All right, we have the Neon Box. Dun, dun, dun. A bright star in this uh, dark time. All right, so this is the Spring Break Edition. And uh, during this Spring Break, I hope everybody's doing okay. It's uh, pretty nasty out there. This is for Marches, so we'll go over our little pamphlet later and... Ooh, Got a pretty awesome figure. Let's see, we have some little cakes up front. I don't know what kind of cakes these are. So, we'll look at that later. Over here. What is this? I have a mechanical pencil. Oh, this is a uh, Totoro. Okay. That's kind of neat, or interesting at least. Little, uh, little mechanical pencil. Let's see, we also have... Oh, this is a loyalty bonus. So, this is a JoJo's uh, Bizarre Adventure Emblem Key Holder. Uh, you can see there, but uh, if you subscribe for certain periods of time, I believe it's like... Uh, Every three months, like three, six, and then a year, you get uh, certain free items. And this is one of those free items. God damn, this thing is like, this thing probably weighs all of about two pounds just on itself as a key holder. But basically, you just put your key into it, and that's what it is. But this, and this is all metal. So, it's, I'll never use it, but. It's interesting, and it's, I mean, this thing is heavy, like super heavy. So that's, that's kind of interesting, a nice little extra. I wonder, yeah, so just a little information on the back of, you know, basically just how you put it in there. It's just a key holder. Usually, the, usually they're plastic, though. So we have a, ooh, that's awesome. This is a, uh... Mini Q figure from Akira. Uh, I wonder if this is what it is. Let's crack this open. Let's see, is this the bike? No. Darn. I really, really wanted the bike, but it is uh, still cool. Obviously. It's him uh, probably early, early on in the trans transformation. You get a better picture of it on back. It's the bottom left one right there, but oh, I really wanted the bike. That would have been so awesome. All right. Let's put him back in there. Okay. And we have more stuff. Ooh. That's a bowl of some time. And we have a Pikachu lip cup. Or lip cup cup. Ugh, excuse me. So this is a Pikachu uh, cup lid. Whether it's for your uh, ramen or any other style of instant noodle or just coffee. You can see right there. You put it on there. It keeps it hot. keeps everything all nice and toasty. Uh, I actually have a couple not like uh, cup lids like this. But they're the little figurines you put on to make sure your uh, actual little paper top uh, stays covered. And this is our home item. So, ugh, this is going to be a pain in the dick to open. Alright, there we go. Okay. So, what kind of, this is definitely a bowl. It's too big for a sake bowl, so it's probably a rice or some type of small serving bowl. And it is a little cherry blossom, a little Sakura style bowl, but I don't know. It's kind of weird. There's no branding or marking on it. I don't know if I'd put rice in this though, because you can feel like the grain from the glaze and without any style markings, you don't know if this is for food consumption or not. It's a lot of bowls, especially like... Here's the key. If you get bowls like this from like uh, when loot anime used to be a thing, 
almost all of their bowls were for non-food consumption. So like, they would give you a nice little branded ramen bowl, but it's not for food consumption. It's not safe for food consumption. And they would hide that in like the, uh, the little fine print. And I don't know. It's just one of the things that kind of angers me. But speaking of things that don't anger me, which are completely awesome, we have our figure. I believe this is from a uh, Euro camp or uh, I believe it's uh, laid back camp in America. Our main star, boom, look at this. That is awesome. What is that, uh, Matashiko? Man, I love these figures we get with Nihon Box. Now, obviously this box is a little beat up, but I'm not, uh, it's not like I'm gonna buy it for the box. But all in all, awesome. I mean, this is an awesome figure. Oh, and that is it. Let's see if we got everything from our pamphlet. Good Lord. Got a lot of stuff in this box. So we have our mechanical pencil from my neighbor Totoro. We have our Pikachu mug cover. Our laid back camp uh, Narashiko figure. Our Akira figure volume one. And it could be one of random. We have our rice bowl in Sakura patterns. Uh, each year, blah, blah, blah. So, okay, that's interesting. So each year in Japan, March and spring are defined by the long-awaited cherry blossoms, which is where we have all the cherry blossom festivals and a lot of uh, festivals, all, all in told, rather. Next month's box will be 100% Sakura-themed. I just hope they uh, don't have any Sakura from Naruto. Uh, until then, here's a beautiful... Uh, and made in Japan rice bowl uh, with cherry blossoms printed all over it. And our little cakes are Doriyaki. All right. So that was it from this month's uh, Nihon box, which was an awesome box. Uh, so the rice bowl being handmade, uh, I don't know if it would be good or not as far as, you know, putting actual rice in and I'm a big fat American, so I'm never going to use that for just rice because, well, I eat more rice than that. And we also got our extra item for being a long-term subscriber. All right. And that was it from this month's Nihon box. All in all, an amazing box. So much worth the money. All right. So let me know what you guys thought about this box. Obviously, I thought it was awesome. Thanks for watching, and you be awesome.